Look at you now. Look at me now. Look at you now. Look at you now. Thank you, Wayne. Well, people were looking at Amy Schumer now when she appeared on the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon on Tuesday night. And that segment went up on YouTube right after it aired on NBC. And it has just under 100,000 views right now on the Tonight Show YouTube channel. Wednesday morning, right around the time that Amy was on Good Morning America. It's so good to have you here. <laughs> thank you for having me. Happy Valentine's Day, <laughs> everybody. You too, well, you too, thank yeah. you. A Twitter user uploaded a clip from the Fallon interview and wrote, I'm going to need all the surgeons and doctors to weigh in here. Serious question, what happened to Amy's face? Is it normally this size? Please welcome back the fabulous Amy Schumer. started to gain traction by the time Amy was on The View, three and a half hours after GMA. And then by about 4 p.m. today, which is about the video had been up for about 33 hours, that tweet had been viewed 24.6 million times. Yeah, so Amy felt it was time to respond. So she took the Instagram and wrote, Thank you so much for everyone's input about my face. I've enjoyed feedback and deliberation about my appearance, as all women do, for almost 20 years. And you're right, it is puffier than normal right now. I have endometriosis, an autoimmune disease that every woman should read about. There are some medical and hormonal things going on in my world right now, but I'm okay. Historically, women's bodies have barely been studied medically compared to men. The book All in Your Head does a good job explaining this. I also believe that a woman doesn't need any excuse for her physical appearance and owes no explanation. But I wanted to take the opportunity to advocate for self-love and acceptance of the skin you're in. Like every other woman slash person, some days I feel confident and good as hell, and others I want to put a bag over my head. But I feel strong and beautiful and so proud of this TV show I created, wrote, starred in, and directed. Maybe just maybe we can focus on that for a little. I had backup dancers on Fallon, but my face is the headline. Ha ha ha. Anyway, I hope you enjoy Life and Beth. Love and solidarity, Amy. And her image was the season two poster of Life and Beth, which starts streaming tomorrow. I did see that tweet yesterday. Yeah, I wasn't going to cover this unless, yeah, Amy um, responded to it. It just blows my mind that people... Um, Take the time to speculate. Yeah, like, I mean, watching that clip, I don't think it's wrong to notice that, yeah, something's going on, something looks different in Amy's face. Yeah, that's fine. But, I mean, take the time to tweet about it, and, hey, surgeons and doctors weigh in on this, and, like, everyone's, you know, has an opinion on it, and it's just like, yeah, like, obviously something's going on with Amy. Yeah, her face looks different. Yeah, like, it happens to people. Like, I mean, just go about your life. <laughs> I mean, if Amy wants to talk about it, then she'll talk about it. Like, why is it affecting people's lives that, like, they're really taking the time to analyze or, I don't know, like, have their opinion about what's going on with Amy's face. Once again, it's okay to notice it. Yeah, I, like, yeah, I noticed it too when I first saw the clip. But yeah, to speculate on it, yeah, it's Amy's business. And if she wants to comment on it, she'll comment on it. Like, it just blows my mind that people, um, you know, take it to that level where they're like, yeah, tweeting about it and analyzing it. Anyways, what are your thoughts?